right, here are the boots. Aren't they fabulous? All right, so let's talk about clothing. <laughs> yeah, it, right, there you go. Okay, let's talk about clothing. You don't have to dress conservatively to be taken seriously. Make sure that all the parts that you want to cover are covered. Make sure, here's the way to dress for your body, never put, if, in terms of if you're worrying about looking skinnier, okay, it's not just about wearing black, if you're worried about looking slimmer, never put a horizontal line at the widest part of your body. It's really simple, dressing for your body is really simple, okay, just never put a horizontal line. I put my belt that came with this sweater here because it's way above the widest part of my body. So we can do that, belt thin, belts are in. You can look at what's in in fashion. In case you were wondering, purple berry is the color of the season. So if you wanna look at what's happening in fashion, you may wanna look and just use that as a guideline. You do not have to dress fashionably, but you have to decide who you're going to be. For example, if you work at IBM, I never have an audience of people who work at IBM. Some of you guys work at IBM, which is so cool, right? But IBM, in, in, the, wor in the mind of the world, is the most conservative environment on the planet. It, right, it was the navy blue pinstripe soup with the, I mean, it, wow. So what I want you to do is dress for the environment and then add yourself to it. Add yourself to it because life's too short to get lost in who you are at work. Okay, and one of the ways to express that is through your clothing. Add a funky earring, add a funky scarf, add a great bag, yes. Who has a favorite outfit? Who has a favorite outfit that every time you wear it, you look great, you feel great? Yes, a lot of us. How many of us are wearing it right now? Why? What are you doing? Why are you not wearing it? Right? Okay? You want to have all of your clothes in your closet should look good, feel good, and fit you. Okay? Anything in your closet that doesn't look good, feel good, and fit you, get rid of it. Here's what happens. When we're in masculine mode, we are um, running on testosterone, okay? Testosterone in women is, you know, men have a factory for it, woohoo. Women don't. Um, testosterone in women's bodies comes from our adrenal glands, which is why so many women are exhausted and stressed out and unwell and unhappy and, and can't get pregnant because there's too much testosterone and all of this stuff going on. So the way to be in feminine mode when you're setting your intention and your clothing, and by the way, the other two were body language and touch. The touch is the handshake. You guys all know how to do a good handshake in this room. I don't really have to go there. Make sure that the web of the hands actually touch when you do a handshake. Do you know why? Do you all know why? The heart meridian runs from right here between your thumb and your forefinger, up your arm and into your heart. Energetically, when you shake someone's hand and you make that web-to-web -web connection, you're touching their heart. Oh, I just got all kinds of goosebumps from that. It's fascinating how nobody really talks about that and how instinctively that's what showed up. Isn't that amazing? How instinctively what showed up was the handshake. It's a heart-to-heart -heart connection, so make sure when you shake someone's hand, and you'll actually, now that you know this, this is something you'll never forget, which is so cool, you'll actually start feeling it, and it's really cool, okay? The other piece of this was um, body language. You all know. Um, okay, everybody, just really quick, take a deep breath. Sit up straight in your, sit up straight in your chair. Okay, now, take a shallow breath and slump. And put your head down and slump. Okay, and take a really shallow breath. Now stay where you are and be happy. No, 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 I'm not kidding. I'm not stay there, head down, breathe really shallow. Really shallow, be happy. Be happy. Be happy. Really hard to do, right? You ever see anybody who's depressed? How do they hold their body? Like this. Okay, now, take a deep breath, sit back in your chair, sit up straight, look up, smile big. Look up and smile, take a really deep breath and smile. Look up and smile, look up and smile. Okay, there's no reason for that, it just really looks cool. Um, no, I'm, <laughs> I'm kidding, seriously. It is almost impossible to be unhappy when you're sitting up straight, smiling, and breathing deeply. It's almost impossible. So notice your physiology, notice when you're talking to people, notice if your head is up or down, and notice where the energy is flowing, and that is how you create a first impression with impact. I had the best time, you guys. Have an amazing afternoon. And Namaste.